G'day, g'day, and welcome. So today, we're going to be having a little bit of a look at a Extra Flow Air Cleaner. Not a very catchy name, really, is it? TF, TF1, TFI, Racing's Extra Flow Air Cleaner. Hmm. Okay, so this was like, oh, about 130 bucks, I guess. What the go is, is it's uh, basically a K&N rip-off. Uh, this, uh, this whole thing is cotton. Obviously, it's breathable all through the top here and all around the side. Uh, this one's got a, uh, a recessed base to fit my poly double pumper. And, yeah, so let's... Let's, ooh, what have we got here on the back? Uh, okay, these are some of the accessories that it does not come with. Um, it does not come with the bloody screws to push the bastard down with. Um, you can buy them online. I've seen like those ones there, those ones there, those ones. I've also seen like a billet type one um, that uh, well, pretty looks like the bloody lid on that, like that sort of thing. They want 25 bucks or something for it, so I'm just going to do one up on the lathe, I think, if I really want one that badly. Besides that, I've got a wing nut that'll fit it, so uh, we'll just see how it goes anyway. It comes in um, three different colours. You can have it in red, blue, or black. Um, I've got this one in black, even though my car's blue. Uh, I think it might look a little bit sort of gay, really, I suppose. Um, yeah. So, anyway, let's... Uh, Let's have a go, shall we? It's quite a nice box. It's pretty... Holy Jesus. Wow. This thing is fucking enormous. Oh, listen to that V8. Yeah. That sounded pretty good. Nice one. Oh. Let's uh, bring this on down a bit. What do we got? Oh, look, they gave us some stickers. Oh, cool. Yeah, I'm definitely putting stickers on my show car. <laughs> um, oh, look, go on the fridge. Yes, doggies, thank you very much. So every fucking time I start to record something, my dogs. Roof, 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 roof. All right, let's see if we can get on with this, shall we? Oh, crap. This thing is. Absolutely. What have we got here? Okay, so it doesn't come with any of that shit, but it does come with a, a couple of nuts. So <laughs> it comes with a couple of nuts. Right. What have we got here, boys and girls? Okay, so this is our recessed base. And um, these points here go on the holly carby because it's got two bolts that stick up um, on... Uh, on either side of the floats. Uh, I'm not sure why they designed it that way, but it does. Uh, also, they've given you an imprint here in case you want to put a uh, a uh, bloody um, return valve in. Um, what's PCV? Yeah, in case you want to put a PCV in. Um, yeah, so that should that should fit my carby with a bit of luck. Um, I'll see whether I can see through it. Yeah, no, you can't really, really see through it very well. Sniff test. That fucking stinks. They reckon it's pre-oiled, but it certainly doesn't feel very oily to me. Um, this part of the filter, this is... Wow, that is really... Really flexible. Really soft. So... It's fucking huge though, it's enormous. So let's chuck it all in there. Okay, it wants to keep popping up. I think they could make this bottom lip a little bit bigger, which would be nice. Because, yep, every time I push it in there, it keeps popping up on the other side. That's a little bit annoying, there you go. No, fucking still doing it. So you're gonna try and hold it down and push it in. There we go, okay, I think that's right. Now let's try that. Come on, there we go. Nice one. Alright. Uh, no, it looks like it's pretty good. It, it looks like it's fairly decent sort of quality. Um, for a, you know, for an eBay special. 
really. Um, and you can get it in red or blue. I think I definitely prefer it in black. Really depends on how much it's going to show up the dirt though, doesn't it, really? But Alright, so I'll go and shove this on the car and um, we'll see how it looks, shall we? It's fucking huge. It's enormous. It's what I wanted though. I wanted a nice big one. <laughs> That's what she said. Alright. That's it. Let's go check it out in the car and we'll see how it looks. Alright, let's uh sorry about the horrible audio, but let's pull all this off. This is this other one I welded up and fixed up. Put all this off. Geez, lucky I uh, put rags in there. Look at the fucking shit that's falling in there. That's a ring I made up. I need to start this up soon. It's been sitting for a little while. So these are these fucking bloody bolt screws, whatever the fuck I was talking about. They go in here, supposedly. Let's see, shall we? Yeah. They sit down there. Look at this girl in here. Like I said, it would be better if they had a fucking big lip on that thing. It just wants to keep popping out constantly. Now, is that sitting down properly? Or is it going to leak? I think it's okay. Let's put this girl on. Like such. There you go, that that doesn't look half bad actually, that's not too bad. Well, that filter there is about $400 cheaper than a K&N. Would you buy one? I think it looks all right. It's not too bad. I've got a K&N on my other car. I obviously haven't any problems with it, but the fact it's friggin' expensive. Once I get this thing up on the road, I'll do another uh, review and let you know what I think of it. All right, there you go. So it looks all right to me. What do you reckon? Comment below. Let us know what you think. Until then, be good, stay safe, and we'll see you around like a wrist, old trendsetters. Techno, techno.